What's up, guys? So I was on uh, freesound.org and digging through some cool sounds, and um, then I got a brilliant idea. So I was also searching through Ableton's file structure and found exactly where the metronome samples are stored. Now, for this process to replace them, uh, we need to first have Ableton closed. Um, but we can right-click on the application and show package contents, then go to app resources, miscellaneous, metronome, and samples. Now that we have the folder open, we can just copy and paste our new samples in. Now, we're not done yet. We need to rename the existing samples, something like underscore old, and then name our new samples what the original name was. Once we've renamed our samples, we can go ahead and open up Ableton, and now we can turn on the metronome. Now, one thing to know is that it looks like it's clipping. My original samples were definitely not clipping, so um, there's some sort of gain structure added there. Um, so let's just turn down our metronome. But um, now you know how to import your own samples into the metronome, so go have fun. Enjoy. <laughs>